So in just a few short weeks, I'm gonna be stepping off onto the Appalachian Trail. And today I'm gonna to share with you the nine things, the nine modern conveniences from my home that I will miss the most. Stick around. Hello, hello. My name is Holly and I do carnivore hiking videos. I'm going to be through hiking the Appalachian Trail starting in May. And so between now and then you can expect videos to come out two to three times a week. And once I hit the trail, videos will be coming out four to five days a week. They will be on Mondays. I primarily will focus on meat Mondays and what I'm eating as a carnivore on trail. On Wednesdays, I plan on doing just random things and uh, Fridays are going to be Faith Fridays. So I will be posting all three things on this channel. Tune in to whichever day tends to be your favorite or all of the above. Stick around for the adventure. Glad to have you along. So item number one that I will miss the most is going to be my air fryer. I use this baby every day. I use it to cook all my meats in. I reheat. I use it as a dehydrator. It gets a lot of use. So my first thing that I will miss when I hike the Appalachian Trail is going to be so the first thing that I will miss is going to be my Pampered Chef air fryer. You too will be missed. The next item that I will miss is going to be my Magic Bullet mixer. I use this again almost daily. What I do, I'm, a lot of you know that I'm a carnivore and so I eat uh, meat and dairy and what I like to do in the mornings is make a blended coffee and so I use butter, salt, and coffee. Mix it up and this is the way I froth it. I also do vanilla lattes which are basically water, butter, and vanilla with salt. Blend that up and it makes a frothy creamy drink just like this. So moving on to the third thing that I will miss the most from inside my house is going to be my flat iron. As somebody who wakes up looking like this, you can see why a flat iron is necessary. <laughs> You're gonna get to see lots of that on trail. And again, going back to the fact that I do eat a lot of meat, having a freezer full of meat is probably close to number one. I don't have these in any particular order, but very, very high priority is my freezer full of meat. It's gotta be missed. And going back to the whole coffee thing, our bun coffee maker, it's gonna be missed. Although by the time I come home from trail, I hope to have kicked the habit. We'll see how that works. And next on our list, one of the things that I just, one of the things that I purchased about a year ago is a mini waffle iron. Isn't it cute? And I have started making little pizzas out of it or waffles. We call them chaffles because they are wheat free and they are carnivore friendly. And I make them a lot for my grandkids and they don't even know the difference. It's amazing. So my mini waffle uh, iron or maker is going to be missed. 
Now I could sneak this into my backpack, I think, but I won't. All right, this one is definitely gonna be missed. I use a diffuser in one, two, I have them in four rooms in our house, or five, four, four rooms in our house, and I use a diffuser daily, diffusing different essential oils. I do not burn candles, nor do I use the plugins or any sprays uh, because of the toxicity in them. And I've replaced that with essential oil since 2018. And so my diffuser will be missed. Now I am still taking two essential oils for sure, maybe three. And I will let you know at some point what those are going to be and why I think they need to be in my bag. Okay, I think you all know this next one and why it will be missed. washer, dryer, clean clothes, it'll be missed. So I struggled a little bit with this final one and there's two, two additional items that will be missed, but I think the one that's going to win out is going to be my Instapot. It's actually an Express Croc. It's the Croc Pot brand. And I love cooking brats in there with sauerkraut. I don't eat the sauerkraut, maybe a couple bites, um, but I do eat the, the brats and I love that. And I do just a ton of other things in there. Uh, bone broth and stock and all kinds of yummies. So that will also be missed. So I'm making this video just kind of as a fun thing for me to for me to do. I'm not really going to miss these things enough to obviously make me stay at home, but they're just things that we've gotten, I've gotten used to using on a daily basis and um, it's just kind of fun to think about what I really will miss and then probably compare it to what I actually did miss when I'm on trail. So that is what I was doing for today and I just want to, as always, say thank you for coming along on my journeys. I would love to hear what you guys would miss most from your homes. If you were to leave on a six month journey, if you're somebody who is curious about the way that I eat and wanna see my carnivore food list, there's a link to that in the description as well. And I'd love for you to have a free copy of it. So go ahead and feel free to download that. So three tasks, I'm giving you three things to do. No, actually two. So two tasks, comment in the video what you would miss the most if you went on a six month journey. And number two, is download one of those free gifts. Thank you for coming along on this journey and I look forward to seeing you on the next one. Take care. Bye.